CJU Initiative for Children with Special Needs uh, Child has called for support and collaboration from parents, governments and caregivers for children with special needs. The president of the initiative, Kawan Andofia, who spoke with newsmen at the New Sea Child Centre in Abuja, said that the centre would create more opportunities to enrol children who were on the waiting list and also provide them with sustained care and basic services needed. Cowan said even though cerebral palsy was not a disease and cannot be treated, it can be managed. Cerebral palsy is a, can we call it a, a, little, a little paralysis of the part of the brain when a child is being conceived in the womb, we call it a fetus. When the fetus is in the womb, whichever thing the mother suffers that could result to damage in any part of the brain will result to cerebral palsy. It may also occur during uh, delivery. We call it a prenatal, a perinatal and a postnatal uh, stages of problem. When we say pre, that is when the child is being conceived in the womb. Whichever drug that the mother takes that is not prescribed or overdosage or an illness that, a mother, that affects a mother while carrying that child in the womb can result to cerebral palsy. When we had these children, we had no places to take them to. There were no places where we could take them for care and that's why we said start up this place. Specialists are very, very expensive and so far this place is founded by individual funds, my husband and I, few other partners and friends. So we have, few, we have two physiotherapists that do tech physio services for these children for now. We are catering for cerebral palsy because that's what the condition my children were born with. That's what I was exposed to and that's what I know and that's what I'm handling. It's not enough recognition for children living with special needs in our society. Uh, it is downgraded really. They are in a position where they do not get, receive adequate care, you know, especially because they are children of special needs. Now, uh, the implementation of the Disability Act involves, you know, you know, governments as the primary uh, person with uh, responsibility. Government has primary responsibility and then individuals and groups also have a responsibility. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.